Well, as we wrap up 2022, we're looking ahead to the new thrills that are being unveiled right here at our Central Florida theme parks in 2023. From a sci-fi roller coaster to a competitive blaster game, Westview's Meg Mulatto has the lineup. That's the sound of excitement coming from riders on the Tron light cycle coaster in Shanghai Disneyland. But soon fans of the digital world won't have to travel to China to ride it. It'll be right here in Central Florida at Walt Disney World in 2023. It's pretty breathtaking. Rob Alvey with Theme Park Review got the chance to experience the sci-fi adventure in Shanghai. The visuals were stunning um, both outside the building and inside the building. The ride itself was really, really fun and and, and it's, it's a, it's a high paced thrilling ride, but it's also very family friendly at the same time. Um, I mean, I think kids are going to love it. And especially with like Tron and Space Mountain kind of right next door to each other, all of a sudden Magic Kingdom is going to have this like little like pocket of thrill ride sort of tucked away in this kind of corner. Over at SeaWorld Pipeline, the surf coaster is also set to debut with its surfboard shaped ride vehicle. This will be, I think, the very first stand up roller coaster that will have been built in, in 20 something years. So it'll be kind of interesting to see the evolution of that style of, of, of roller coasters. And also the company that, that that's building it, you know, they've also built all of SeaWorld's, most of SeaWorld's other coasters, you know, Kraken, Mako, Manta, they all came from the same company. Universal Orlando will be unveiling Illumination's Villain Con Minion Blast, featuring an interactive blaster game, cementing what the theme park is calling a Minions-themed land in the heart of Universal Studios Florida. Epcot will be introducing new neighborhoods and experiences too, but Alvi says even more is yet to come. We just saw, you know, at Animal Kingdom, uh, you know, in that dinosaur area, they, they just pulled down two of those roller coasters. And if you know Disney, they're not going to spend the money to pull down a ride if they don't have something planned for, for the future. Megan Mulatto, WESH 2 News. All eyes also be on Universal as construction continues on its new theme park, Epic Universe, for any potential announcements. I we'll have to wait a little longer for Epic, which is set to open in 2025.